Listen, the Lord is exposing the culprits in your life. What is the culprit? Oh, the culprit is the criminal, right? The culprit is the one that did something wrong, right? The culprit is the one that think they're getting away with something, but God really sees, you know, what's going on and God really sees what's happening, right? So many times, you guys, you may wonder why certain relationships break up or certain things just don't work out the way that you wanted them to, right? Whatever that thing is, it's because the Lord stepped in, right? The Lord stepped in. Sometimes there can't be certain things in our lives or people or like those things are going to hinder what God wants to do in your life, right? And there's people that you just don't know, you know, like their true color or their true character. Um, you only know what it is that you see, but you know, God sees behind the scenes and he sees those things that you don't see, right? So whenever God breaks up a relationship or whenever God does something, it's re because he's ready to do something. And you can feel that thing in your spirit. You feel like it's long overdue, like you're just waiting and waiting and waiting. But you've been feeling this perception of something about to happen, but it's just not happening. It's because there's something blocking it. Like I said, when certain people are in your life, many times the people are sometimes there for just a reason, a certain reason. And just for a season, but sometimes the season is over. And a lot of time we still have the person um, in our life or we're still doing that thing that God is already, you know, the time is up for that thing, right? So, you know, when you try to hold on to something or there's something there when God wants to bless you, but that thing can't be there, like it's going to hold up your blessing. And that's kind of what you're feeling, right? That's kind of what you're feeling. So God is exposing um, the culprit, right? God is exposing, he's showing you the manipulator. He's showing you the little tricks and the things that you feel in your mind, like, oh, why would this person do that? Or, wow, that wasn't a nice thing. To say. Like he's revealing little things to you about this thing or this person or, and so your mind, he's already showing you little things, but it's like, because maybe you can't see what's happening, you're just not even accepting it or believing it to be true because it's not what you see. But God sees what you don't see. You see what I'm saying? So, yeah, um, when things begin to break up and shake up in your life, know that it is God that is doing it. Know that it is God is, that is doing it. And I do know that many times when things begin to do that to your natural mind, it's not going to make sense. You're going to try to figure it out and you're going to try to. But you never will until God shows you why. But he's going to show you why later right so that's why that thing that you're feeling is being delayed because there's something there that needs to go right i don't know what that thing is i pray that the lord is revealing it to you who it is or you know whatever it is but there's something that's blocking or holding up you know your blessing that thing that has to go like god is already kind of um showing you like you're feeling it about this person or this thing like you're feeling that right but this person has to go so that God can give you what it is that he wants to give you. Sometimes uh, everyone can't go with you to where God wants to take you. Oh, did you catch that? I'm just saying, right? So you got to just trust God. He is exposing the culprits in your life, right? And I'll say this, you guys, whenever God shows us something, whenever God reveals something to us, meaning something that you did not know. So when he brings to light a situation or a person or a thing or something that you did not know, it's called a revelation. So when God reveals something to you, you can't just mix it off and say, no, I don't see that how that could happen. That's not. No, God is showing you something. He could show you through a dream. He could show you through a vision. He could even allow you to see something or he could allow you to hear something. Or he'll allow you to see like, dang, why would they? That's crazy. Like you getting those little things. He's trying to show you these things all along. But when he reveals it to you now, child of God, there's something that you have to do, right? God ain't going to make you do it, but he's going to show you. And then you have to use your own wisdom as to how to change the situation. Did you catch that? All right, child of God. So God is exposing the culprits um, that many of you already know, you know, but you have a, a move to make. You have a move to make. There's something that you have to do. All right, child of God. And I pray that this word um, bless somebody and maybe brought some wisdom um, to your mind. But that thing that you're feeling, 
God is wanting to do something. He's about to do something, but there's a person or there's something there that's hindering that. And until that goes, then you're going to stay where you are. So, like I said, sometimes it's got to break stuff up. You know, I pray that as I'm bringing this word, the Lord is showing you right now what that situation is or who that person is or whatever that thing is that's blocking your next level. All right, child of God. So, um, God be blessed. May the angels of the Lord encamp around you all, keeping you safe from any and all harm or danger. In Jesus' name, be blessed.